previously on Decker. They want to blow up Central Park with a nuclear bomb. Today. Today? I can go and stop this attack if you give me the tools I need to end this madness. Give me the tools. On behalf of America, I want to thank you for saving us from the terrorists. You're welcome. How did you do it? Once we broke the code and figured out how to access the secret documents, it was easy. You see, I can read and speak Arabic, and I dis determined that the plot was, in it was to blow up Central Park. Incredible. Once I got that information, I headed to the park and stopped the terror attack with brute force. And I couldn't be happier with the results. It's what saved America. Incredible. Decker, you're, you're a hero. What's incredible is how you failed to use the constitutional authority guaranteed to you by our founding fathers to use force to protect the homeland from these savages. Don't you realize that as commander in chief, you have the power to bomb these people back to the Stone Age? When will you ever learn that your administration is a disgrace? You, all your pathetic attempts just to try to get through this term so that when you come out you can go on your stupid book tour and give your pathetic lecture circuit. You sold this country a bill of goods and now the chickens are coming home to roost. I agree. Uh, right, I, I should just resign and make you president. I would recommend this. But I'd refuse. I'm needed out there in the shit protecting you and us from people that want to do us harm. And thank God for that. You deserve the Medal of Honor. I know, and I do accept the Medal of Honor. Now, if there's anything else, Mr. President, I wouldn't mind barring Air Force One and heading off to Hawaii for a vacation. You got it. Mr. President, you'll never get my vote, but you have my respect. Coming from you, that, that means a lot. All the best. Decker truly is our most valuable national treasure. And I am a big fan as well. We're lucky to have him. Be safe in Hawaii, Decker! I really love Decker. My fellow Americans, I come to you with disturbing and yet great news. An agent of the United States of America has saved us from peril. Single-handedly, he has crushed a plot to destroy America. He has saved Central Park, and he has saved the Super Bowl. And I designate the following Sunday a parade in his honor down Broadway in New York City. Unfortunately, this brave, brave agent will not be able to attend because, of course, his identity must remain secret. And you know who you are. Our country owes you a gratitude and thanks. God bless you, Agent. And 
God bless America.